He is known for being a renowned scientist and engineer from Wales. He is recognized for his contributions to the development of railway safety and communication systems. His name is William Henry Preece. In the world of scientific pioneers, one name stands out, William Henry Preece, a Welsh engineer whose contributions to the field of telecommunications are nothing short of remarkable. Born in Carnarvon, Wales, Preece's journey into the realm of engineering began at King's College School and King's College London. His thirst for knowledge led him to study under the renowned Michael Faraday at the Royal Institution in London, where he honed his skills and passion for innovation. Preece's expertise in engineering caught the attention of the post office, and he soon became their consulting engineer. In 1892, he was appointed as Engineer-in-Chief of the British General Post Office, solidifying his position as a leader in the field. It was during this time that Preece made significant advancements in railroad signaling systems, revolutionizing railway safety. His improvements paved the way for a more efficient and secure transportation system. Throughout his career, Preece maintained a correspondence with Oliver Lodge, another brilliant mind in the scientific community. It was during one of these exchanges that Lodge proposed the concept of loading coils for submerged cables. However, Preece, in his brilliance, did not initially realize the full potential of earthing, which would extend the distance and efficiency of these cables. This oversight serves as a reminder that even the greatest minds can sometimes overlook crucial insights. William Henry Preece's contributions to the field of engineering, particularly in telecommunications, were truly groundbreaking. His innovative mindset and dedication to improving safety and efficiency have left an indelible mark on the scientific landscape. Preece's story serves as an inspiration to future generations, reminding us of the immense impact that individuals can have on the course of scientific progress. In the late 19th century, William Henry Preece made a groundbreaking discovery in the field of telegraphy. Gathering a group of men at Coniston Water in the Lake District, Preece accomplished something remarkable. He successfully transmitted and received Morse radio signals over a distance of about one mile across water. This achievement marked a significant milestone in the development of telecommunication. Not stopping at radio signals, Preece continued to innovate. In 1892, he developed a wireless telegraphy and telephony system. This system, similar to the telephone system patented by Alexander Graham Bell in the United States in 1876, was implemented in England. Preece's work in developing and implementing this telephone system showcased his prowess in the field of telecommunication. Working alongside Arthur West Heaviside, Preece made another important discovery in the realm of telegraphy. In 1885, they conducted experiments with parallel telegraph lines and an unwired telephone receiver. It was during these experiments that they stumbled upon the phenomenon of radio induction, a significant finding that would contribute to the advancement of wireless communication. However, Preece's relationship with the Heaviside brothers was not without conflict. Preece blocked the publication of some of Arthur and Oliver Heaviside's work, leading to animosity between them. Oliver Heaviside, in particular, considered Preece to be mathematically incompetent. The tension between them stemmed from Preece's desire to protect his own reputation and avoid admitting any mistakes, rather than any genuine flaws in the Heaviside brothers' work. Through his discoveries and innovations, William Henry Preece left an indelible mark on the field of telegraphy. His achievements in transmitting radio signals and his contributions to wireless telegraphy and telephony systems revolutionized communication and paved the way for future advancements in the field. Do you want to explore more scientists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.